Hello everyone, dear friends. Today we are going to build Lunar Moon. We will have three rounds in total, and you decide who won in the comments. Are you ready, Mikey? Of course, JJ. Then let's start. Round one. For the first round, I will need gray, black, and red concrete, as well as quartz slabs. I'm starting construction. First of all, I build blocks in the air. I'm building a platform out of gray blocks. Now I'm building walls on all sides. Now using different colors, I'm building a face. Great, I'm done outside. I put a block in the back, a ladder, and make a passage. I'm putting the door up. Hmm, it's time for furniture. I'm putting up a bed, I'm putting up a workbench and a flower in a pot. I'm putting up chests, stoves, and an armor rack. I'm putting up a torch and painting my armor red. Now I'm hanging the armor on the rack. Great! My Lunar Moon house is ready. I wonder how Mikey's doing. Wow, Mikey, you've got a great Lunar Moon. Well done. Thanks, JJ. But I can't wait to see what you built. Follow me. Wow, JJ, what an amazing Lunar Moon you have turned out to be. Great! Thanks, Mikey. Round two. For the second round, I will need blocks of cobblestone, black and red concrete, as well as quartz slabs. I'm starting construction. First of all, I'm building one block of cobblestone high in the air. Now I'm building a big platform in the air out of cobblestones. I'm building walls of the same shape on all sides. I continue to build the framework. I'm also building the upper side. Now I'm finishing the corners inside. Now I'm building a face using red and black concrete, as well as cobblestones and quartz slabs. Almost finished. Great, I think I'm done outside. I'm making a pass from below. I'm finishing the cobblestone blocks inside and building a flat floor. Now I'm putting the ladder all the way down. I'm putting up the hatch. Hmm, it's time for furniture. I'm putting up a bed, a bedside table, and a lamp. I'm putting up anvils and decorating them with foliage. I also decorate all the corners with foliage from above. I also put anvils in the back. I put cabinets on different sides, as well as shelves for clothes and shoes. I'm putting up bookshelves and an enchanted table. I'm hanging paintings. Great, my Lunar Moon house is ready. I wonder how Mikey's doing. Wow, Mikey, you have an amazing Lunar Moon house. Well done. Thanks, JJ, but I can't wait to see what you've built. Follow me. Wow, JJ, your Lunar Moon house is simply magnificent. I like it. Thanks, Mikey. Round three. Hmm, I think we need something special. In the third round, I use the command and put a ready-made lunar moon. Great. I'm making a pass. Now I'm using a command and removing a large number of blocks from the front. Hmm, for the construction I will need black and red concrete, as well as quartz steps. I'm starting construction. I'm building the eyes of my lunar moon using red and black blocks. First, the right eye. And now the left one is exactly the same. Now, I'm completing the face of my lunar moon with endstone blocks. I'm still building. There's not much left. Great half is there. 
great, I'm doing wonderfully well. Now I'm building my lunar moon's mouth. Using black blocks, I'm building a black wall. I continue to build the framework. Great half is there. Now using quartz steps, I'm building the teeth of my lunar moon. Almost finished. Great, I'm done outside. Hmm, now I'm going to need a wooden axe tool. I'm making a pass. Now I put an end stone block and use the command to fill the space inside with earth. I'm removing some blocks from the top. Instead, I put blocks of white stained glass. Almost finished. Now I'm completing the missing blocks of land in front. Great, I'm doing wonderfully well. In the same way, I fill all the places with earth where there is a shortage of it. Hmm, I have an idea. I am copying one of the houses of our village using a special command. Now I also use the command and put this house inside Lunar Moon. Oh, these blocks are superfluous. I think it turned out great. Now I will copy different houses from our village and transfer them to my Lunar Moon. Friends, tell me, what would you build inside your Lunar Moon? Write your suggestions in the comments. I will choose the most interesting ones and you will be able to see them in our next construction site. I really like this house, so I'm going to build two of them. Now I'm building a cobblestone frame around the center. I'm also completing the foundation and building blocks from below. As you may have guessed, friends, this will be the well of the village, which is located inside the lunar moon. Now I'm building wooden poles in the corners and completing the roof of the well. Great! I'm pouring water into the well. Now you need to decorate the village somehow, otherwise it's really boring in it. That's why I'm putting lanterns all over the village. Now I take bone meal and fertilize all the land in this wonderful village. Just look, guys, how fast the grass and different flowers grow. Hmm, something is still missing. Precisely. I'm hosting a whole bunch of different villagers in this village. I put someone in the house and someone on the street. And you're in the well. <laughs> I'm putting the door up. Great, my super huge lunar moon is ready. It's time to check out what Mikey did. Wow, Mikey, hmm, friends, did you notice that too? If so, don't tell Mikey, he'll be surprised. Great, I really like your lunar moon house. It's so spacious inside. Thanks, JJ, but I can't wait to see what you've built. Then go ahead, Mikey. Wow, JJ, what the? JJ, our lunar moon are very similar. What a cool house you've got. What have you built inside? Oh my god. You've got a whole village here. It's amazing. What am I doing here? <sighs> Thanks, Mikey. I think we can end this. Thank you all for watching, friends. Like and subscribe to the channel. And also don't forget to click on the bell to not miss new videos. Bye-bye. Hello, dear friends. Today we are going to build a house in the form sheep. We will have three rounds in total. And you decide who won in the comments. Are you ready, Mikey? Of course. 
JJ. Then let's start. Round one. For the first round, I will need ceramics, white and black concrete, as well as red ceramics. First, I build legs. I make a base on them from white wool. Almost finished. I build my head. I make a nose and black eyes. Finishing the frame, I put small ears. Great. Now is the time to work out my house in detail. Using chiseled bit, I build on top of the plate to free up space inside. Almost finished. Just a little bit left. Now I'm removing the extra blocks. I change the block and put the door. I'm putting up a ladder. We need to change these blocks. I put a bed, a workbench, a flower in a pot, and a chest. I put a stove and a torch. Great! My sheep house is ready. I wonder how Mikey's doing. Wow! Mikey, what a wonderful house! Do we need to go down? Of course, JJ. Wow, it's very nice here. Thanks, JJ. Rather, show me what happened to you. Follow me. Wow, JJ, your house is beautiful. Thanks, Mikey. Round two. For the second round, I will need white ceramics, gray concrete, light gray, as well as pink wool. I'm starting to build the same way with my feet. I build the second leg, and then I finish building the wool. I put the wool so that it looks like an adult sheep. Almost finished. Just a little bit left. I'm finishing my hind legs. I bet wool. There's not much left. Now I'm building a framework. Changing some block. It seems that this is where I need to finish. Great! Now I'm building a head using different colors. Almost finished. Great! Just like the real thing. I continue to build the framework. Great! I'm doing wonderfully well! Dear friends, tell me what would you like to add to such a house? Write the answer in the comments. Now I'm closing the empty space. Finishing the lower part. Great! The house is almost ready. Now, with the help of chiseled bit, I'm working on my house in more detail. I'm making small eyes. I'm making a tail. Making a pass. Now I'm putting up a ladder and a trapdoor. I put a bed and a bedside table. I put wardrobes. Make an invisible shelf. And put a lamp. I'm hanging a picture. Wonderful. My house is ready. It's time to check out Mikey's progress. Wow. Mikey, what an interesting design. This is a very joyful sheep. It's very cozy inside. Thanks, JJ. And what happened to you? Let's go quickly, Mikey. Look at my house. Wow. What a wonderful house. Just amazing, JJ. Thanks, Mikey. Round three. For the third round, I will need boards, white wool, pink, black and white concrete, as well as the golden block. I'm starting to build big and tall legs. Now I'm building a foundation on them. I'm starting to build a very large building. I continue to build the framework. Just a little bit left. I continue to build the framework. 
I'm doing great. Almost finished. Also on the other side. Just a little bit left. It seems that this is where I need to finish. Now, with the help of the command, I fill the empty space. I do it from all sides. I keep filling the voids. I finish building the frame from above. I'm continuing construction. Almost finished. Building a head frame. Great, I'm doing wonderfully well. Filling the empty space. With the help of different blocks, I build a face. I'm sure I'll make a wonderful sheep. I continue to build the framework. I make black and white eyes. I'm completing the frame of the head. Almost finished. I also use the command to fill in the empty spaces. Just a little bit left. Hmm, I think it's worth adding something. I take the gold blocks and do this. I continue to build the framework. There's not much left. Ha! It turned out great! Very similar. Now, with the help of chiseled bit, I finish building the panels on my legs. Great half is there! I make a pass and remove the extra blocks. I'm building a floor. I'm putting the door up. I'm putting up a ladder. I'm finishing the blocks up. I'm building a floor for a floor. I continue to build the framework. Now I'm finishing the stairs. Filling the empty space. I'm building a Doral Natelny floor. I'm removing the extra blocks and completing another floor. Just a little bit left. Hmm. I think we can arrange the furniture now. I put a bed, a bedside table, and a lamp. I put anvils and decorate them with grass. I put a big sofa. I put the bear skin. I'm hanging a picture. I'm putting a kitchen set on the next floor. I'm putting the microwave on. And here's the refrigerator. I put a table, tea service, and chairs. I'm putting up a closet. On the floor below, I put a TV and a white sofa. I hang up the clock, put up the bookshelves, and put up the sofa. On the very first floor, I put a jacuzzi. I'm putting on a shower, as well as a wash basin. I'm putting the toilet on. Now there are four blocks, and I hang a curtain over them so that no one peeps. I'm removing the blocks. I almost forgot about the toilet paper and towel. Closing the empty space. Hooray! My house is ready. I think it's time to check out the Mikey. Wow, Mikey, what a huge sheep. You tried very hard. Wow, how spacious. Great design. I really like your house. Thank you, JJ, but I can't wait to see what you've done. But I warn you right away, there's a little surprise. Probably another test. Well, let's see. Follow me, Mikey. I'll show you. Wow, your house!
J, this what? Just a little decoration. Okay. I hope everything is different inside. Oh, there's a shower room here. And the TV. Great. So, and on this floor, there is a kitchen, of course. And here's the bedroom. Wonderful, JJ. Thanks, Mikey. I think we can finish. Thank you all for watching, friends. Like and subscribe to the channel. And also don't forget to click on the bell to not miss new videos. Bye-bye.